Hi everybody, welcome to a new video and happy new year. So in today's video I am doing my go-to eye makeup look. It's very simple, very easy and I figured why not because this will suit a lot of skin tones and complement a lot of skin tones and brown eyes because you know black makes brown eyes stand out. Mm -hmm. So I am using the Naked Palette by Signature Cosmetics. This is a dupe for the Urban Decay Naked Palette, if you guys didn't know. I have a new piercing on my nose. <laughs> I've never had my nose pierced before and it's been interesting having a nose piercing. And also don't forget to check my description bar because I will be linking all the products that I use, all the brushes that I use, where you can get it from, so on and so forth. Also previous videos and how you can contact me on Facebook and Twitter if you just want to talk to me or communicate with me or whatever the case may be. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you for always supporting me. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like my video, share my video and subscribe because subscribing does not cost a thing. So the first thing I'm doing is priming my eyelids because I want my eyeshadow to last all day long. This is the primer that did come with the Signature Naked Palette. I'm gonna take this bronzing color from my Blush Bronzer Duo by Avon and I'm going to put this into my crease because this is a nice neutral shade as a transitional color. I'm just very sloppily or very sloppy putting it into my crease. I'm gonna take this shade Dust. It's a champagne color with like gold flecks in it. It's very very pretty and I'm just gonna put this on the first two thirds of my eye. I'm then taking the shade Smoky and I'm going to apply it to the outer corner of my eye just building it up slowly and also blending that color into my crease. I'm going to go back to that brush we used at the beginning and I'm just going to brush it through my crease with no extra product and just blend out the colors in my crease. I'm going to take the shade Urban and I'm going to put it in between that smoky color and that dust color. I'm then going to go back with that smoky color and I'm going to reapply it on my outer corner just making it a bit darker. And then I'm taking my Essence Super Fine Eyeliner and I'm going to draw a winged liner. I would definitely recommend this pen. It makes life so much easier. I'm then using my LA Girl Pro Conceal HD Concealer in the shade Warm Honey. And I'm highlighting the center of my face as well as concealing my under eye circles. And I'm just going to blend this out with my Boutique Precision Foundation Brush. I'm then going to set all the highlighted areas with translucent powder. I'm going to take my Avon Glimmer Stick in the shade Black is Black and I'm going to line my waterline. I'm going to take that smoky color on a an angled eyeliner brush and I'm going to put it on my lower lash line very thin. I'm taking my... All Eyes On Me Essence Mascara. I'm actually using two mascaras because it just gives me a better effect. And I'm going to apply this to my eyelashes. My top eyelashes as well as my bottom lashes. I'm then taking the Get Big Lashes Mascara by Essence and I'm also going to apply that over. I'm taking the Sun Club Matte Bronzing Powder and I'm going to bronze my cheeks or rather contour my cheeks, my jawbone, my nose, my forehead, all that great stuff. Careful not to hurt my nose. Um, and yeah, simple. I'm then going to take this nice pinky toned blush and I'm going to apply it to my cheeks. I'm going to take my Design Bronzing Brick and highlight my cheekbones. Then I'm going to take the setting spray that I made by myself. I will link it down below and I will tell you the ingredients. And then I am lining my lips with a brown lip liner. And then I'm taking the slip color, I did do this in a previous tutorial, the slip color combination. I'm mixing the shades Purely Pink and Gabera from Avon. So thanks for watching. Bye!